Palestinian Christians are leaving because uh, they don't have a sense of hope. Um, they want to seek a better opportunity uh, elsewhere outside. But I also believe they are leaving because uh, they haven't embraced their calling yet. Uh, uh, they haven't embraced their calling to be uh, the light of this world, of this land, uh, the salt of this land. Now, Bethlehem area is suffering more than any other area in the West Bank from the uh, different conditions imposed mainly by the Israeli occupation. Bethlehem is surrounded by a wall. And uh, the Bethlehem population cannot reach very easily to other areas in the West Bank. This diminished the economic development in Bethlehem area. So we have less job opportunities. A lot of young people and graduates of universities are not able to find work. Uh, actually, we, we asked people this question uh, in, in a survey uh, we did 2008. Uh, uh, we asked them, uh, what are the reasons for immigration? And uh, what we found out was really very interesting. 32%, so basically one-third, uh, said uh, they want to leave because they don't feel uh, secure and they don't have freedom of movement. 26% uh, said they are leaving because of the deterioration of the economy, so basically economical reasons. 20% uh, uh, said um, they are leaving for political instability, which really means they don't see a light at the end of the tunnel. They don't feel that a solution is in sight. Uh, and then 12% uh, are leaving to pursue higher education abroad, and they are not sure if they are going to come back. Uh, around 6% said they are leaving for family reunification. And uh, it's interesting, less than 1% said they are fleeing because of religious extremism. The relationship between Christians and Muslims in Palestine is not always a rosy one. However, it is a one of respect. Although tensions sometimes arise between both communities, but this is not as a result of a systematic discrimination against us. It's sometimes as a result of uh, daily normal problems that may occur between minorities and majorities. I think the Palestinian Christian community is a vital component of peacemaking. And the sad reality is that many people think that by just economically supporting the Palestinian Christians, this is a means to keeping them here. I want to go further on this and say, how can we encourage the Palestinian Christian community to be the fullness of the body of Christ in this land? Yes, economics is very important, but I also feel that spiritual food and nourishment of the Christian community in this land is very important. So recognizing the local Christian community, honoring the local Christian community, building relationships with the local Christian community is a very important component of strengthening that presence in the Holy Land. A very important reason to stay is for me faith. And uh, knowing that as Christians, uh, our place is not where the sun is shining uh, and where life is easier, but our place is there where we are most needed. And I think Christians are uh, most needed uh, today here in Palestine and here in the Middle East.